Hey everyone, in the news this week, the official portraits were released of the coronation and seeing King Charles in a big purple hat, he really looks more and more like his mother every day. Following the coronation, though, the actress and Joa Addo stirred up controversy by pointing out that the balcony had been, quote, terribly white. There was no follow-up suggestion, though, as to how to resolve that perceived issue. Most of the royals are already married, of course, and Prince Andrew remains one of the few remaining single royals, except he's also in his 60s, and the left surely aren't suggesting that he get married to a young African girl in her 20s and start siring children. I mean, he'd be up for it, but it's hardly a good look. One final word in the coronation must be the mention of the drone display that they put on outside Windsor Castle. It certainly upstaged the efforts that Putin and Zelensky have put on. And I guess that brings us to the other story, which is Eurovision, and how it was supposed to be held in Ukraine, but for political reasons was hosted in Liverpool. It's a real shame because according to the news, Ukraine has some huge open air arenas these days. And also because hosting Eurovision in the city the Beatles were from is frankly disgraceful. It's a bit like getting Noel Edmonds to host a show with a gunge tank and then filming it inside the British Museum. The RMT union tried their best to protect the general public by holding a rail strike, but in all honesty, they really should have got Zelensky to do a missile strike. As to the UK, we came second to last, which made me want to briefly check the news to see if we'd invaded Iraq again or something. And finally, Joseph Fritzl is writing a book, and it's going to be curious to see whether more people want to hand their hard-earned money over to him rather than read Prince Harry's diatribe. When asked about the sales projections, one industry said that Fritzl's book was going to be a bestseller. <clears throat> anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe.